Hello there, and assalamu alaikum. Today's video is about inserting a video into your InDesign document. And uh, when I say video, it could be a video stored locally on your computer, or it could even be a YouTube video. So let's get started. Here I have a new document created for you in Landscape. So first of all, let me create a text box on one side to add some text. And now let me right click and fill it with placeholder text. Now we'll need media panel. So if you don't see it on your right, go to window and then interactive and you'll find media sitting under it. So click on it and from the media panel, Click on the button sitting at the bottom right corner, which is for placing a video or audio file. So if you have an MP3 file, you can easily add that as well. For free videos, I can suggest this site, which is uh, pexels.com slash videos. And you can download short clips from here. This site is also good for photos. So feel free to browse through. It can be really helpful. Now, since I already have my YouTube video saved locally, I'm going to use one of them. So I'll click on my video and select open and you'll find the cursor is now pregnant with the video. Now I'm going to drag it onto the vacant space of my document. Then right click on the center of the video where there is this circular icon. Go to fitting and select fit content to frame. So if you watched my earlier InDesign videos, you'd know that this feature adjusts the content based on the frame size. Play the video on media panel to check if it's playing well. Let's also check on the EPUB interactivity preview, how well this is going to play once we publish it electronically. You'll find the EPUB interactivity preview panel under window, then go to interactive and select EPUB interactivity preview. Play the video on the interactivity preview panel. Uh, it's always better to check the preview on the interactivity panel because this is how others will receive it after publishing the interactive document. Now, obviously, when we insert a video like this to our InDesign document, it's going to increase the size of the document considerably. So alternatively, what we can do is embed a YouTube video or even a Vimeo video if possible. So let's learn how to do that. I'm going to go to my YouTube channel and pick a video. So let me pick the latest one I uploaded yesterday. Now you'll find the share option under the video. So click on it once to reveal a pop up where it gives you several options to share. Since we are embedding this YouTube video to our document, we're going to click on embed. You'll find links, characters, uh, words that will not make much sense to you unless you're a software genius. So just hit copy and get back to our document. Now here go to edit and paste. Let it load, might take a bit. All right, it's here. You might have to wait a little longer and it will load in its actual dimensions. And you'll find this error message. Just ignore the message that says uh, your browser can't play this video. Let me make some space for this video. So I'm gonna drag my text box down to about that much. And uh, let me also remove the video we linked earlier. So select and delete. Goodbye video. All right, so let's again right click uh, right at the center where you find the circular thingy and uh, go to fitting and then fit content to frame. Perfect, and let's check how it's looking in the EPUB interactivity preview. And I think it's looking perfect. All right, so congratulations, guys. You've just learned how to insert a video from your computer as well as from an external site like YouTube. So I hope you've enjoyed the video and have learned something new from it. So I'm going to see you in the next one pretty soon. Signing off. Thank you.